Welcome to my channel Swiftlearn. In this tutorial, I will show you how to create formula field and how to use formula field in Crystal Report in BB.NET Windows Palm application. If you don't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. I start SQL Server. This is my server. Server name is catalog sbr now click on connect this is your SQL Server authentication I expand the database in object explorer uh, my database name is uh, my test DB I expand the table and my table name is student info underscore tab and the uh, column uh, columns are student ID name address age contact and date of birth select the record these are the records in SQL Server database table uh, my test DB and student info tab Okay, now and uh, this is the client PC a start visual studio 2015 okay now I'm gonna create a project and uh, I'll create crystal report finally I will uh, show you how to uh, create formula how to add formula in crystal report using bb.net okay windows name the uh, application application name is add formula and crystal report tutorial click on ok ok my project is created research the form and now design the form uh, with level control and the button control and uh, crystal report viewer first of all I'm gonna add a level control this level control I'll use uh, as a title of this page font uh, expand the font uh, in the properties font size is 16 and font bold true okay font bold true and text of this uh, level control is uh, add formula and crystal report bb now change the back color of this form select the form and change back color back color is uh, uh, yes now uh, select the label control and change the fo font color this level control button height ok now add button control from the toolbox and design this button control uh, to change the text of this button and button text is loot and uh, uh, for, co uh, for color is change the font size uh, font bold true and uh, font size is 10 ok now font color is button highlight and back color of this button is uh, select the back color of this button uh, back color is violet uh, no, ok <coughs> now uh, go to the toolbox and add a crystal report viewer control just drag the crystal report viewer and drop uh, in the windows form application resize this uh, crystal report viewer okay now uh, uh, you can see in the left side uh, of uh, crystal report viewer a groove tree now select the groove tree non yes now no group g go to the solution explorer and uh, now i'm gonna add a crystal report right click and add uh, new item uh, yes in the left fan select reporting and select crystal report it's selected crystal report name the report my report name is student uh, info report dot rpt okay now my crystal report is added click ok and create new connection expand the oledb.edu oledb provider for sql server click on next this is the sql server authentication so server name is catalog uh, hyphen sbr you already seen in the server and is already sa and password is sql server authentication password and uh, database is my task db it uh, load automatically but it's not loaded uh, maybe i uh, type mistake uh, put password again and uh, select yes uh, my task db 
Let's uh, click on finish. Okay. Now ask for the data with my test DB, ask for the debut and uh, add the student info tab. Click on next and finish. Okay, this is the default text uh, print object. And, uh, now I'm gonna design this report with the column in the student info tab a student ID and then the student name and the student address, age, and contact date of birth. Note that I'll uh, add formula um, according to the ID uh, according to the age column, blank column for formula field. Okay, now select the heading and uh, un uh, underline false and uh, bold font bold true. Now design with the line uh, so that it's look like a table. Okay, just copy the line and paste for the necessary. Okay, horizontal and vertical line. Uh, it's now looking like table so I'm gonna go to the report preview then you can understand uh, when you go to the report preview you can understand uh, how it's look like yes now it's look like table but before the contact uh, I missed uh, uh, line okay now it's okay again yes uh, the blank you can see a blank column now uh, I'll display uh, how to add formula field in custom report first of all I'm gonna load report what I already created in that case this is default kind uh, this is the existing connection uh, I am uh, showing you how to connect newly add connection uh, server name catalog uh, hyphen SBR authentication as password authentication username s and password is scores authentication password and uh, uh, database name is metasdb click on test connection succeeded click on ok and now it's connected to the visual studio and you can see table student info underscore tab now i'm gonna write code to display um, uh, crystal report in report view crystal report viewer in this form application dimcon as new sql connection connection add import system data to sql client and to get the connection listing right click on the database click on property and double click on connection listing copy and paste it in the sql connection you can see user id is sa okay but password is a star so you should put your password sql server authentication password okay now ask a command my SQL command is uh, just selecting all the records uh, from the SQL Server database table. So, dim command is new SQL command uh, select star from student info tab. What I have already seen uh, shown you in uh, Server Explorer. Okay, now data adapter dim SDA as new SQL data adapter. Uh, data adapter command call the command okay now dim dts new data table sda dot fill dd okay okay now i'm gonna write code to load data in crystal report okay dim rpt as new uh, crystal report my research report name is student info report this is the crystal report name what i added in solution explorer okay now rpt dot uh, set data choose dt dt means data table and what i load sda finally crystal report viewer one dot report source uh, equal to rpt crystal report uh, viewer one dot refresh and then rpt dot close rpt dot dispose okay now debug it's debugging yeah click on load oh an until exception dot net file assembly c program files oh 
could not load file or assembly file uh, what is the problem to solve this problem I have to add code in uh, FFV config file I go to the solution and uh, uh, open the fv.config file in the startup just uh, write this code use legacy v2 runtime activation policy true ok now click on load yes and report displaying perfectly now I'm gonna add formula field in that case go to the field explorer and uh, in the formula field just right click and add new formula for our name is virginity click on ok yes now in the report field just double click on is if student input underscore tab dot is greater than or equal to 18 i mean if the student's age is greater than or equal 18 then uh, it's uh, then uh, it will display the task else uh, it will display the in the column uh, virgin okay now just save and close yes now just drag this uh, formula of, uh, field uh, and uh, drop it in the crystal report formula column okay now debug again click on load yes you can see uh, 17 so virgin 16 virgin but 20 35 18 25 18 is uh, tasked